Today we're talking about skin purging and skin irritation, the difference between skin purging and skin irritation. Now, have you ever started using a new skincare product only to find out that you're having more breakouts on your skin? Hey, Flawless Skin Gang, welcome back to the channel, your ultimate guide to everything skincare and beauty. On this channel, we take you through a captivating journey of skincare formulation. We show you how you can make your own skincare products at home, how you can start your own skincare business, and everything that has to do with skincare and beauty. So if these are things that you're interested in and you would like to see more of our content, please join the family by subscribing down below, hit the notification bell so you are notified every time I put out a new video. Thank you so much for subscribing. Hi, my name is Sele Kalio and I am your skincare guide. If you're a returning subscriber, hey best friends, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm a little under the weather, so please ignore my struggles, okay? <laughs> Today we're talking about skin purging and skin irritation, the difference between skin purging and skin irritation. I've been having a lot of you know, complaints about customers who use a product for the first time and they tell me, oh, your skin, your product is making me break out, your product is making me um, have irritations and all of that. So um, when you explain to them what exactly is happening, they feel like you're trying to make excuses. So today I wanted to take this time to make this video so you understand the difference between skin purging and skin irritation so if you like to see or you like to learn more about this topic please keep on watching now have you ever um, started using a new skincare product only to find um, that you're breaking out and you might be thinking that this product is not working why am i using this product why am i breaking out when this product promised to clear out my skin well hold up don't complain too much because this could just be a process called skin purging. Now, skin purging is a reaction to a skincare ingredient that accelerates the skin's cell turnover. Essentially, this is your skin bringing out all the um, underlocking um, breakouts to the top layer of your skin essentially this is your skin bringing out all those locking under the surface breakout to the top of the skin at an accelerated pace what this means is that these products are helping push out all the pimples acne and all of those clogged pores and all to the surface of the skin and this can be done with active ingredients like retinoids, um, alpha hydroxy acids, some um, exfoliants, basically ingredients that help with cell regeneration or cell turnover. These are the kind of ingredients that can trigger skin purging, but don't worry about it. Skin purging is actually a good thing. It's a good thing. It shows that the product that you're using is working. It means that the product is effectively clearing out your pores. Now, on the other hand, we have skin irritation, which basically is a reaction to a product that your skin doesn't agree with. You see the difference? One is helping clear out your pores and clear out your skin. The other one is giving you reaction from um, the disagreement with your skin and the product that you're using. So there are two different things. Now, skin reaction happens if your skin products, are, your skincare products are too harsh or you might be reacting to one or more ingredients in that formulation. Now, unlike skin purging, skin irritation will not improve over time. If you keep using the product that is irritating your skin or that you are allergic to, you keep having the same allergic reaction. While on the other side, when you talk about skin purging, the moment the underlocking 
um, breakouts and all of those things are cleared out, your skin begins to get better and you begin to see the results of the skincare products that you're using. Now, symptoms of skin irritation can be redness, itchiness, burning on your skin or dryness. Now, if your skin is irritated to or is allergic to the skincare products that you're using, you should discontinue immediately. Now, I know that a lot of you will be asking, how do I now know what skin irritation or skin purging looks like? Or how do I differentiate? Or how do I know I'm actually purging or I'm, I'm allergic to the skincare products? Now, the easiest way to differentiate between skin purging and skin irritation is the area where it is happening on your skin. Now, skin purging will generally occur or appear in areas where you usually have breakouts. So if you have breakouts on the jawline of your face all the time, you will see your skin purging happening around that area because there's a possibility that some um, breakouts have not actually gotten to the surface, so it will push it all the way out to the top layer of the skin. Whereas irritation or skin irritation can happen anywhere. Now remember that skincare product is not a one product fit all. Everybody's skin is different and what works for someone else may not necessarily work for you. So it is best to always carry out irritation tests to make sure that these products will not cause any allergic reaction to your skin. So basically put the product on a small area of your skin for maybe a few days to make sure that that product is compatible with your skin. Otherwise, don't use it. So that's all for today. I hope this video was able to help you understand the difference between skin purging and skin irritation. Hit that like button if you found this video helpful. Share it to your friends and family that might be going through the same issues so they can learn as well. And remember, the journey to a clear skin is a marathon and not a sprint. Stay patient and stay radiant. And I will see you guys tomorrow in another video. Now, if you have any reason to want to speak to us about trainings, about our skincare products or anything else, please use the link in the description bar to reach us on WhatsApp. And we will be happy to assist you in every way that we can. Again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow in another video. Bye.